hey there scorpios and welcome back for another general love reading shout out to all of you beautiful amazing scorpios i know that the day that i'm doing this video is uh february the 14th and um we know what type of day it is you know but don't you get caught up in the hype don't you believe the hype here scorpios uh love is continual okay one day cannot define a lifetime of love okay so I love you, Scorpios. You are lovable. You deserve love. Some of y'all may have options around this day. So love is all around you, Scorpio. Shout out to you, beautiful, amazing Scorpios. Thank you for returning. If you are new, I am Brown Eyes here at Truth Revealer. <laughs> it's Truth Revealer channel over here. But I'm Brown Eyes on my other channel, uh, Miss Sharon, all right? So this is a general, if it resonates, please like, share, and subscribe to this channel. So if you're in that empress energy, that fertility, childbirth, somebody, you may be um, birthing something new. You could have a spark of fresh creativity or um, ideas. Somebody may actually be about to give birth here. You do have fertility and childbirth, which is that empress energy, a uh, growth expansion here. Uh, nurturing energy, mothering energy. It says whenever you intend to give birth, your experiences will impact your emotions, mind and spirit for the rest of your life. Now, whatever it is that you're about to birth into the world, it could impact the rest of your life here. So I feel like it's going to be something beautiful, beautiful and amazing here. For some of you guys that you are in this Empress energy, you are going to attract a lot of um, it's not just for this day. No, it's just, I just feel like it's just going into the spring. It's almost like everything is starting to come alive here. Uh, you could be that person here who is going to pop next, who, uh, you got a lot of attention on you. Um, uh, you could be that queen of the ball here where you're going to have a lot of people, uh, all around you admiring you. And it's not going to just be for the opposite sex. It's just going to be for your, your energy is going to be attracting all types of people. People just going to want, you're going to be so intriguing here. Everybody's just going to want to get to know all about you here. And, and, and like I say, you, you're just going to be the talk. They, they talking, but they ain't got nothing bad to say, though. That's the difference. See, it says think and live like a queen, honey. It says a queen is not afraid to fail. Failure is another stepping stone to greatness here. See? I feel like somebody got their eye on you too. See, especially I'm getting the queen of wands, empress energy here because the queen of the ball, we already know how she get down now. You know, I'm just saying she ain't going to play it safe. She's going to make it do or what it do because she knows she can have it. And I know I'm talking to Scorpio because I feel my Scorpio help coming in here. I feel you. So like I say, I'm feeling that empress, that empress, uh, queen of wands energy. For somebody here, I feel like some of y'all got multiple people here because one of these cards says get the first kiss. So this could be somebody here who you're wanting to date or you're already dating, but it's just the beginning stages. And then it could be somebody that's trying to, it says get courage and dare could be somebody here that want to kiss you so bad. Okay. <laughs> oh, it says the best feeling in the world is kissing someone for the first time when you've really wanted to kiss them for a long time. See? See, and then you have a courage, get courage and dare, see? So it could be somebody who, who is checking you out, looking to got light a fire. It says many may have discovered fire, but one man discovered how to play with it. <laughs> and I can see that in that queen of wands, empress energy that it seems like you're operating in. It's almost like you're lighting fires. Okay. You're like, you, you better take a fire extinguisher everywhere you go. <laughs> it says now. Being deeply loved by someone gives you strength while loving someone deeply gives you courage. So this could be somebody here who is digging you that has always wanted to kiss you, always wanted to be close to you. Like I say, you could have multiple people. You could because your last card here is love triangle. Ooh, child, do y'all got multiple people? It says don't let two men, Scorpio, fall in love with you. It's not the sort of thing that ends well. Ooh, 
that's what it say underneath the bottom it got light of flight light your fire and it got to reflect on your actions here so somebody really wants to get close to you scorpios but i feel like you have multiple people for some of you guys you got somebody here from your past that you're still involved with but you got this new person that's daring because they just want to just get close to you because they feel like everybody wants to be around you and i see why somebody say i smelt you as soon as i woke up this morning and you're the last thing i smell when i close my eyes at night <laughs> <laughs> don't come for me that's what they feel about you Scorpio. so you must be a bad a scorpio a shut your mouth see the empress she got that baby and queen of the ball see <laughs> that's your overall energy the queen of wands and that empress in some type of love triangle because of multiple people are attracted to you because you are attracting them now your overall energy and this is the high priestess here Ooh, high priestess pisces energy i wonder is this somebody here is this, is this your energy or is this them you got a king of swords Ooh. oh my gosh we're not gonna start that so you could be dealing with a Pi pisces they go to chariot darkness into darkness the key to all mysteries so somebody has no you could be you listening to your intuition about a king of swords moving forward or it could be somebody spiritually guided to you with that chariot because you remember this could be somebody daring to come to you okay you remember you got get a dare and take a risk <laughs> somebody wanting to kiss you like I said, you could have multiple people. The high priestess, you got water energy. Ooh. Now look who showed up. The queen of cups. So we dealing with the Scorpios who want love type of energy. And time that queen of cups showing up. I know that there's love involved. So I feel like the queen. So you, the empress represents all of the queens. Ace of Pentacles, baby. And they go to Page of Pentacles, some type of good news. Isn't that pretty? See there? A new opportunity. Page of Cups. Somebody is, see, somebody, that, that somebody got a secret crush on you, Scorpios. Or are you digging them? Because you got the queen of, queen of Cups, so you could be, listen to, you could be spiritually guided to somebody here. You could be, you could feel a spiritual connection. You could be drawn to someone at this time, but I feel like they could be drawn to you because remember you got the fertility, the empress and the queen of wands. So like I said, I feel like multiple people could be coming. Look, there go the world. Could be somebody coming in from across the world, across the seas, uh, completions here, new cycles, new rewards. Could be dealing with a fixed sign, Leo, Scorpio, Taurus, or an Aquarius. What else for Scorpio spirit? What's going on for Scorpios? So there's definitely love and opportunities here. Strength, started than the pre-shuffle. Leo energy, you could be dealing with a Leo. Ooh, they go to King of Pentacles. Is that the King of Pentacles? Oh, King of Coins. King of Coins and the Six of Coins here. Could be having somebody coming in. Like, I feel like you may have multiple people here, Scorpios. What else for Scorpio spirit? What's going on for Scorpios? Oh, crap. Five of Cups. <laughs> oh, and look, they go to Emperor. Mm. So you could have your Emperor, uh... Nine of Wands and the Knight of Wands. And look, that go to Six of Cups and the Tower card. So for some of y'all, you finna get some unexpected communication from somebody from your past. Like I say around this, is like people, people gonna miss you, you know, in that Knight of Wands. <laughs> Let me remind you what your romance uh, uh, card said here. It says fertility and childbirth, love triangle, light of fire, night of wands, uh, get the first kiss, 
get courage and dare queen of the ball then you got to reflect on your actions here it says time decides who you meet in life your heart decides who you want in your life and your behavior decides who stays in your life see oh so maybe somebody wasn't showing you happiness Looking, there go the swords, five of swords, one, two, three, four, five, five of swords with the fool card here. Four wands. So this is some type of twin flame connection here. So somebody's trying to be strong, Scorpio. That's what I feel like. I feel like they're trying to be strong because of you. Somebody wants you so bad. And I feel like opportunity and the passion that they have for you is calling them in. So somebody could be regret be regretting that you're not that you guys are not together now that they're missing you and need. I feel like this a need. <laughs> in this night of ones, yeah, I feel like this is a need at this point. But I feel like somebody is really trying to hold it together, but I feel like they're gonna bust. <laughs> Because you got the Ace of Pentacles, the Page of Cups, Knight of Wands. Yeah, they go to High Priestess again. So let's see what's going on here for Scorpios. Scorpios in love. Spirit, what's going on for Scorpios in love? The High Priestess, the Queen of Cups, the Page of Cups. The World, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces, the Chariot. Ace of Pentacles. Towards Virgo and Capricorn, the world, the Knight of Wands, and the strength, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. You also got the Five of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. So let's see. Let's see what's going on here. All right, let's start off with go to devil. The devil. Doom, 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 doom. Capricorn energy. Talking about the devil, yeah. All right, let's start off here with this. Um, I'm curious, why is the Five of Cups here for Scorpios? Cancel Scorpio and Pisces, reflection, regret, loss, suffering in silence. Uh, could be somebody suffering in silence because they could be looking at you like maybe you're holding back. Maybe you have moved on with this uh, chariot. See, Five of Cups, Four of Cups. Ooh. Somebody said they didn't mess around and lost their lover messing around here. See, the lovers, once again, because like I say, that, that queen of the ball, there she go. Because see, you brought a lot of happiness. Look, you brought a lot of happiness to them. Now they realize they in love and they missing you. <laughs> Something crazy. <laughs> They just keep on talking. This person in love with you and they miss you. Ooh. Somebody said that they hate that they did what they did. They know that much. Because they said they ain't getting nothing now. That queen of ones and the lovers card. So week, week, you already know, like I say, how they feeling against you. But this is somebody here who is in love. But they, they in need of love too. All right. Don't come for me. You shouldn't have did what you had did to this person here. So why is the knight on? Now, what's up with this queen of cups for Scorpio? Clarify the queen of cups for Scorpios. Queen of cups for Scorpio. That's you or that's them. But we already see over here. Clarify the queen of cups for Scorpio. Why is the queen of cups here? Queen of Cups, oof, the magician. Now who is they working spell work on you trying to get you back? They all these tears. Cause they're thinking about you. Now you could be manifesting here. Like I say, they could be doing spell work to get you back at all costs. See somebody doing something. Huh? 
because somebody is losing patience because somebody it's coming though, Scorpio. If this is you manifesting love and you were like, God dang, I got to go through all of this person and be patient because it's coming. Some of y'all may not like who it's coming from though. Because if this is you and the Queen of Cups, you're manifesting here above, you trying to get past the, the mind games and all the big bull crap. Spirit is telling you, you know, be patient, darling, because your patience is going to be tremendously rewarded. You're going to get it. Some of y'all got another water sign or a Sagittarius. Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius here. And the Pisces with the Magician card here. See? Now, why is the Knight of Wands here? Clarify the Knight of Wands for Scorpios. Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. Got Leo with strength. Knight of Wands. Ooh, see? Knight of Wands. The lovers. Doom, 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 doom. See there? See what they got on their mind, don't you, Scorpio? I'm just saying now, 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 look now. Or maybe that's just what's in the energy now. You got the lover's card here twice. You got the ace of wands. You saw the ace of wands. Got the queen of wands with the nine of cups. So you dig? <laughs> see, they're feeling left out of you. See, it's them. I told you it's them. Or maybe it's y'all. See? <laughs> They say out of all the days in the world, why did I have to not be around Scorpio now? I sure could use you now, honey. <laughs> so like I say, somebody that's in love with you, Scorpio, is really, really missing you. That, that's what it is, okay? Somebody that is in love with you is really, really missing you. See? Somebody regrets that they didn't handle things better. See? Somebody regrets that. All right, strength, why strength here for Scorpios? Clarify strength, Leo energy. Oof. I feel like somebody don't want to just rush in and be rude. They, they don't want to be no, they go to chariot and they go to tower, cancel, Scorpio, Leo. Strength. Two of Pentacles. I feel like it's them. That could be y'all saying, I don't know if I could, because you got this right here. You may need to clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now, Scorpios. Some of y'all, you know, you may be manif manifesting here and not believing it's going to happen, but it's going to happen with that temperance and the ace of cups here. And like I said, it could be them really, really wanting you back so bad that they could actually be doing some type of love chant about you. They could be calling your name and things or or or, or, or they're so determined to get you that they may uh, embellish the truth here. Two of Pentacles, somebody don't know what they want or somebody don't know how to get it or, or, or resisting your love may be making them imbalanced. <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about they, they, they bumping in the stuff, you know, that you see. <laughs> King of Swords. I see they, somebody realizing that not being around you is not good for their health. <laughs> see, here it go again. Didn't I tell you? The lovers. <laughs> now that you ain't around, they, 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 they can't find what they need out here. They say it only come through Scorpio. <laughs> And they have an inner conflict about you. That's what it is. See? Five of Wands. Should they, should they, should they give in? Should they try? What, what should they do? I feel like somebody's trying to trying to suppress this strong desire. And I feel like that's that's energy. That's chemistry. You know what I'm saying? It's almost like somebody's trying so hard to suppress their wild desires for you, but it's not working. It's not working. Now what's up with the world? Why is the world here for Scorpios? Completions, travel, um, relocation here, online uh, communication here. Mm. Nine of Pentacles. Now I feel like this is you with a fresh start here. And then this could be somebody else coming in or it could be the same person here. Look, that go to an eight of wands. Some, somebody is coming to you. And that go to freaking king of pentacles. Ooh. 
You got the Empress look. They go to Ten of Pentacles. <laughs> oh, they go judgment. Somebody is single here, Scorpios, and they a boss. I feel like this is somebody new right here. So that's why the triangle is here. I feel like you got you got one person here who is trying to man up or somebody has really, really been trying to suppress the desire that they have for you. And they're really trying to take control over the fact that they have lost you because they miss you. I feel like they're in love, but they do desire you physically. But with this world card, you obviously, if they're regretting something, you may not be with this person. You may have already moved on. And so you may have closed out a chapter or you may have ended things with this connection. Queen of Cups with the King of Swords. We know how that go. OK, it's, it's going to be seen one sided. So in the process of you letting go of this situation, you may have manifested this new love opportunity not thinking about this person from your past because it I don't I don't see them one I, I don't see them making a move to with the exception of the Knight of Wands. But I feel like this is more of them thinking about you kind of really missing you more than anything. But you actually got somebody that's either uh, going to put in some type of action to for you with this King of Pentacles. Now, for somebody else here, it could even represent this Nine of Pentacles with the King of Pentacles. Maybe somebody had to let go of another situation. Because you got the lover's card here twice. Got the two of pentacles. Could have been that this person really was trying to figure out who they want. And they could be still figuring it out, but at least they're maybe they're trying to be wise. And then for some of y'all, it could be all be the same. But let's see. Only you going to know. But I do feel like it could be multiple people here. So why is the page of cups here for Scorpios? Could be somebody coming in to uh, break the ice, apologize, or just somebody new. Uh, beginning stage. This could be somebody here that, that, that see, they go to food card. You remember you hit that take a dare, get a dare, and take a risk. They go to food card. Could be an Aries, could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or a Pisces here. So it could be that somebody here really wants to offer you something, but they don't know if you're going to accept it because now maybe they're missing you. And maybe they after they did all this fighting and suppressing and all those things. Now, maybe they've really given in to the knowledge or the feeling of being in love with you. They go to page of one. So it's some type of communication They go to chariots. So like I say, ooh, see. See the chariot and the king of cups. See, so some of y'all, y'all may have multiple people here. You may have a twin flame, the king and the queen of cups. And then, like I said, it could be the same person here because you got the ace of wands. You got the sun card, Leo energy. You got the tower card. So for some of y'all, this person guard has come totally down. This person could have been, you know, the king of swords. You already know how that is. And then you could have somebody here who is coming in that's looking for something. Because things have changed. Because like I say, you got the ace of pentacles. So whatever it is, it's going to be something that you can see. Why is the ace of coins here for Scorpios? Clarify the ace of coins. Mm -mm. Now, for some of y'all, it's just the same person. Your person is leveling up to the emperor for you. But they're showing up as the King of Pentacles, King of Cups, and the King of Swords. Ace of Pentacles. Seven of Pentacles. Somebody feels like somebody's taking stock and somebody's realizing that it is time for to see some type of results. Okay? Is it worth the investment? But I feel like somebody feels like it is. They go to Tower Car here. Somebody could be C, and there you go. C. It could be somebody from your past and they could be looking at you like, is it still salvageable? Could Is there still a possibility that I could possibly get this after this happening? So for some of y'all, it was a third party, maybe. Maybe their third party was that, that they just didn't want to settle down. But this is how they viewing you, God dang it, as the empress, because you see you got the emperor here. So like I say, somebody looks at you like you are a good investment. 
Somebody may be looking at you like maybe they've put in enough time that it's finally time to take it to a higher level of commitment or put forth more of an effort. That emperor would do that. Somebody that really has feelings for you would do that in that king of cups. So you may have had a person here who didn't want that or who was going to see four ones. See, so like I say, you got twin flame soulmate energy all over here. One more card for the Ace of Pentacles for Scorpios. See, there it is again. See, you can't escape that. You just know somebody going to get effed. OK, <laughs> put that in your uh, plan, your uh, task book. <laughs> You're to put that on your to do list, okay? See, then I said, they said they coming in here to give you everything. They said, whatever, how much, whatever, all of it, that's fine. You can have it all. The fact, I feel like they're saving it for you. Ooh, wee. The chariots, again, cancer energy. What's up with this chariot coming in, doing 110 miles per hour on that expressway? They said that they don't care that somebody could be a sheriff. And they turn their lights on just to get to you. <laughs> so somebody is following their intuition in their heart this time, see? Because somebody don't like not being around you or somebody has learned from their mistakes not to do that same stuff again, see? Somebody learned not to take your heart for it more. Don't play them games, see? There it is, ooh, because look at over here, see? Queen of Cups, the Magician, the Five of Swords here, see? And here, here they regretting it again now. That you don't mess around with love when somebody really, really love you and showing you you don't F with them. You don't play games with love or they'll turn their back on you. And I feel like this is what y'all done did. Y'all done turned your back on this person. Now they regretting it. They crying because they realized that they F'd up. See there? This person was in the darkness. They didn't, they didn't understand. Somebody's King of Swords may have not really taken this serious, but they're taking you serious now. All right, the High Priestess again. See, I feel like this person's connecting with spirit now. Something has definitely changed in this person. They're not even going to come at you the same now. Somebody may start treating you like they are actually freaking in love with you, Scorpio. Dang. So this is for somebody who been in some relationship with a detached cold person here the star the seven of swords see somebody's gonna gonna come back and make it better that's why you got that other ace of pentacles right there because they were dodging they were not being honest they were missing they, they wasn't playing it they, they wasn't doing right by you and i feel like they know that now that's why you got that empress there that's why I got the Ace of Pentacles in the upright with that Empress. Okay? So somebody, for somebody, somebody's finna, somebody's finna come to you and they're gonna start treating you like they are actually in love with you. I write the High Priestess. Ain't that something? Because you got that King of Cups there. You got that Chariot twice. Like I say, see? The tower, see there? This person has been, listen, see? They got to let them guards down now. See, I told you, because all they're trying to suppress it and hold back now, all that's down now. Because they know in their heart and soul that you're supposed to be with each other. They know about you now. Somebody know that they are in love with you. And they couldn't resist you now if they tried is what I'm getting here. See, the nine of pentacles in the reverse here. I feel like somebody here doesn't want to be single. It could be this person. Now, like I say, it could be the same person. Because you got the nine of pentacles, king of pentacles, eight of ones, ten of pentacles. Somebody may have ended something else and coming, you know, and, and now they want to take y'all relationship serious. They go to high priestess again. One more card for this high priestess. Somebody is tapped into their intuition. Spirit could be dealing with someone. They're led by their intuition and by their heart here. Like I say, they're going to be treating you like they're really in love with you. Three of Wands, somebody is now planning and see a future together. That's why I got that Seven of Pentacles here, because they're coming in with that Ace of Pentacles to show you. If they were holding back in the past, they're not going to hold back now, because somebody is learning their lesson here uh, with this... Um, they don't like how they feel. This has been a real strong learning lesson for whoever your person is. 
those mind games is going to cost you everything when you do those things. When you play games, when people emotions here, it's going to cost you to lose. And I feel like this is what they're realizing, that when you play those mind games for whatever reason, it's going to end at the end of the day, cost you losing it and regretting that you had it back. And that's what's going on. All right, Scorpio, this your reading, honey. So if it resonates, please like, share and subscribe.